Hi friends, welcome to 30 Inks 30 Days, day 14. Uh, let's start off by looking at King Lear from yesterday. Pretty. Um, this was kind of a weak showing. <laughs> But we're moving on. Man, I like how fluffy this is getting. Uh, what's today? The next day. Which is this little vial. Which is Sailor Yurameku Kokoroguma. Um, let's go. What do we do? How does life work? We find a pen. I never pick this pen. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow we'll go with that one. Today. Mm, I don't know. It looks brown. You know me. Brown and black are a no-no in my book. Mm -mm. This is going to be one of those colors that's impossible, isn't it? Okay, strangely, I love that. Look, I don't know what's going on with me either, but let's go. So, I never use this. Okay, back. I never use this pen for 30 inks because I have to do a cartridge and I have to wait. You know me, I'm impatient. But I mean, am I? It's not that I'm impatient. I might be. But in this case, it's because I'm trying to like do a thing, you know? And what am I going to edit? <laughs> yeah, right. So this should work. We're doing science. Smash. Did you hear it? It smashed in there. <sighs> Update on the teal Caveco. I picked it up. Maybe I told you this, and if so, I don't remember. So too bad you're hearing it again. I picked it up, and I heard rattling because that's how loose the um, cartridge was. It had just come undone the converter and it's a Caveco converter. I'm so cheesed off. That my Caveco converter does not seem to fit in my Caveco pen that I bought it for. Like, come on, you have one job, fit this pen, you know, you know. Okay, so we're gonna set the pen there. I guess we'll cap it. I don't know why I dig this, but I'm looking forward to it. Yeah. 
Let's see if we can get this to write. So we have Yeah. Sailor Yurameku Kokoro Guma. Totally left enough room for that. It's fine. And this is a Franklin Christoph. Model 45 in salmon glow with a broad sig nib. So these are the inks that look different on the different papers. And if we'll compare them. This one might look mostly the same, though. That is right. It's running out of ink. Oops. Day fourteen. Ink. I haven't had my tea yet. I think I'll make it. <coughs> Excuse me. Ten. Model 45. Neat. It's kind of pink under there. Maybe that's why I like it with this pink, is it like my eye can pick out the pink. <laughs> so it's writing pretty dry, but I think it's just because it's not really flowing yet. <clears throat> it's mostly getting ink from the dip. I gotta move this water. Okay. I thought this was gonna be a mighty splat, but that was a weak one. Let's make it a little more mighty. Tech a mighty. Heck a mighty. Ooh, what's neat is like the edges are like this 
sort of rusty color. I don't know if it's coming through. It's drying really quickly. Might not be the best choice for this pen then, because these are not, these don't seal like super great. They tend to dry out. We'll see, shan't we? Won't we? Shan't we? Won't we? Because shan't need something different. On here, I almost see like touches of blue underneath the pink, red, rust. Look how this coats this vial. a lot of ink. That's a lot of ink. I'm liking this month so far. <laughs> I guess it's the nice thing about picking out all your colors ahead of time. Because <laughs> you can have these pleasing sort of arrangements. Wow, this other one is like already dry. That almost never happens here. Which means after I end this video, I can go ahead and do my calendar page, which you can't see. Um, anyway, so here's day 14. Seoryurameku Kokoroguma, Miss Franklin Kristoff pen. What do you think about my pen pairing? Do you see how it kind of goes? Or are you like, Maria, you're a weirdo. I mean, you might think I'm a weirdo anyway, but do you think this makes me extra weirdo? Let me know. Um, I hope whenever you're watching this, you're having a wonderful day. Take care of yourself. Bye.